devastating when they went forward. It looked as though they could uh, just cut Tanzania apart when they move forward. It will. Yeah, they were efficient. There was a question. I'm not sure offside on the second look. I just wonder if it was a handball, maybe the way it was brought on. The last pass was good, so the efficiency was there. A couple of chances, really, that they've taken advantage of, although Tanzania had plenty of half chances, maybe one or two good chances. Gomez has been up to par in the strike by Ngasa, but certainly they didn't look all that great in the back, and especially in the midfield for me. Tanzania looked always dangerous on the break as well. well one nil at this stage, just past the half hour. And Bastos forwards, and it became 2 0. Same man, Rubinho, with the header this time. Yeah, Bastos did not look good defensively, but I'll tell you what, there was a quality cross, and Rubinho on the far post had very uh, few problems with that one. Another half chance for Tanzania. They continue to ask questions in the first half. Well, just a little too high on that occasion. And this crowd's pretty noisy. It'd be quite nice to see Tanzania score for them, of course, on their big day, because as you said earlier, it's the World Cup final for them, but just to see what Brazil do. Yeah, for them and for the neutrals, I think. this uh, Maybe the crowd will wake up just a little bit, and uh, it'll be a, a little bit better game in the second half, because I just think that Brazil may just take control over it. Well, as you said earlier, Brazil really playing well within themselves against Tanzania. They do lead by two goals to nil, but it's a spirited opponent that they're facing. And the second half is just about upon us. We'll be right back.